Hi everybody! So today I am, well, I found a sort of tutorial slash tutorial I guess on uh, hair chalking. Um, if you guys don't know what hair chalking is, <laughs> I'll insert a picture of the looks you can sort of get over here. And um, so yeah, that's what you can get and accomplish with just these <laughs> little pieces of chalk. Um, obviously you can get a lot larger pieces. These are just like a little sample pa um, baggie of different colors. Um, they come in a variety of different colors. Um, in this video I use the blue one, the dark blue, which is this one. It's sort of mixed in with the green, so. But they also have, um, let's see, this is like a dark green, and then I have to show you the purple, but they have like light blue, light green, and orange, but purple I think is going to be my all-time <laughs> favorite. I am yet to try it, and it's so pretty. Um, yeah, so it's really simple, it's really easy. Um, I got my chalk from a boutique on Etsy. If you guys don't know Etsy, it's a um, it's a website you can go to and you can find lots of homemade cosmetics and um, just a bunch of different things, clothing, lots and lots of stuff. I definitely, definitely suggest you check it out because there's just so an array of different things um, you can find on Etsy. So um, yeah, I got it on a boutique in a boutique on Etsy and the boutique's name is Sherry uh, Sherry Boutique and um, she is an amazing person she was very very kind she sent these out right away to me and um, I tested them out right away and I love them I'm just so in love I think it's so much fun and it's such an easy way to um, give yourself that pop of color without you know dyeing your whole head or if you want to do the dip dye look but you don't want um, just the regular blonde or whatever um, I think this is awesome and it's really fun because it gives you that color and it's completely washable which is a definite plus so I mean even if you have a little girl at home like a 12 year old who you know is like mom I want to dye my hair well no mom hello <laughs> get a little bit of this um, hair chalk, it's special chalk I think, I don't think it's just regular chalk. So um, go get you some hair chalk and you know, you can really surprise her by doing that because it washes out with your next wash and that's it. So it's awesome. I love it. Um, yeah, so if you guys are interested in seeing how I was able to chalk my hair, uh, just keep okay, watching. So the first thing you're going to want to do is um, uh, you're going to want to choose a strip of hair that you're going to color with the chalk. Um, I'm having a really hard time deciding, but I think I'm just gonna go ahead and do um, this strand here. I'm just gonna do a strand. You can also do the dip dye look with uh, the chalk, but um, that's too much for me. I sort of just wanted like a little pop of color. And um, yeah, so I'm just going to take this strand here and work with that. And this stuff is really like, um, you know, washes out and everything else, so I figure, you know what, I'll give it a shot with this one and then whatever, you know, wash it out, try something else. Until I figure out what I like. I think I'm going to do a pretty thick strip because I just really want it to show, so I'm going to do like, what is that, an inch strip? And so then I just went ahead and put my hair up and uh, left the strip that I'm going to color um, down. It's chalk from now, Sherry Boutique and I will leave their link down below if you want to check them out. Um, um, yeah, so it's from Sherry Boutique and she gives complete instructions on how to use her product which I think is amazing and great and really helpful. So um, the first thing you want to do is obviously what I just showed you, um, part your hair choose what you want to color and I am just doing this strip here. So I'm going to go ahead and choose a color. This is the little baggie I got of the chalk and that's what the chalk looks like and I have like a green, a blue, a light blue, an orange, a purple. Purple's like the color and it's like the smallest one. Ugh. But anyways, uh, <laughs> I think I'm going to do maybe blue. I'm going to try with blue. This is what the chalk looks like. So I'm going to take that and I am going to see how much um, color pays off 
from it in my hair. It says to rub it in, but I personally think nothing is going to pay off. My hair is very, very dark. So yeah. Um, the first suggestion is to rub in your hair and see, you know, what pays off. And as you can see, in my hair, not much is paying off at all. So I'm gonna see. So I'm gonna go ahead from here? and dampen the strand. I just have a little um, thing of water here, and I'm gonna just dip my hands in there and dampen the strand. Now, if you have light, um, light hair, blonde, or whatever, I'm sure the chalk will work just on its own, no problem. But considering my hair is super dark and um, yeah, it just doesn't want to happen for me. I'm going to try this again. As you can see, there is color coming off onto my hair, which is awesome. Hands are going to be super dirty. You can also dampen the chalk if you'd like, so I'm going to try that. Probably a lighter color would have worked better in my hair. Maybe not. I'm still not sure how well on camera this is going to show. I find using my hand like this and just rubbing it in is really getting like everything um, colored, so to speak. Oh, it's blue. I don't know if you guys can see. It is turning blue, so that is so cool. My hand is a crazy mess, but don't even worry. It's all washable. I'm not worrying about going right to the top because my this is going to be underneath my hair, just sort of popping through, so it won't. Um, really affect anything. Okay, so now that my strand is all blue and my hands are crazy blue, I'm gonna go ahead and wash my hands and then I'll show you what to do next. Okay, so next you're going to take either a flat iron or a um, curling iron or anything like that and this is just going to help um, actually, you know, build in the color to your hair.
So once I have it all in, oh, now you can really see the color, which is pretty cool. I'm going to just take a wide tomb comb and comb through that. Um, keep in mind, uh, when you're using these chalks, it will give your hair a different texture just because it's chalk and it will be a more drier and whatever texture but as you can see it really worked really well on my hair so that is so really because cool. it dries out your hair so much and um, whatever um, they claim that you know your hair will go back to normal after but I'm sure really fun okay I'm gonna take my hair down and now I have a big blue streak in my hair how fun is that um yeah and it's just sort of like a peekaboo it's right there I love this stuff to be honest with you this is so cool I just forgot if you um, want you can add a little bit of hairspray also to the um, portion part just you know it will help lock in everything and I'm gonna go ahead and finish up my um, hair yeah thank you guys so much for watching I'm so sorry that I'm I actually don't have the chalk in my hair anymore to show you. I can insert some pictures right here. And um, yeah, that is what it would turn out like on you um, as My son well. is here, so I'm sorry. But um, yeah, <laughs> that is about it. If you guys have any questions about hair chalking, just let me know. Definitely check out Sherry's Boutique if you're looking for some uh, well-priced and um, really good quality ch hair chalk. I really enjoyed the product and I'm um, looking forward to trying out some more and you know different colors and whatever and I'll um, be posting lots of pictures on Instagram so definitely go check that out. Um, if you're not following me on Instagram go check me out on Instagram. If not you can follow me on Twitter and I post the pictures right to Twitter too so they come from my Instagram onto my Twitter. Um, other than that I think that's about it. If you guys, again, have any questions, comments, concerns, leave them in the bottom bar. If you have any related videos, feel free to leave them as video responses. I love seeing your guys' videos, and I think it's just so much fun. Um, remember, if you're coming to IMAT uh, Toronto 2012, um, be sure to let me know. And also, check out my blog. I have lots of blog posts. I got my Beauty Box 5, so I'll be doing that blog post probably tonight. And yeah, so come check that out. Thank you for watching, everyone. Bye.